In this video, I'm going to show you how to put hand-drawn animated text or drawings over your video. Now to do this, you'll need to have iOS 11 or above installed on your iPad because you will need to be making use of the screen recording feature that is now built into iOS. So what I'm going to quickly show you how to do first of all is how to quickly add that to your control center. So from settings, if you go down to uh, control center, uh, customize controls, and then from there, you'll be able to add screen recording to the include list. And what that means is you'll be able to access it really easily from your home screen. You can see it in the top right hand corner, just underneath the Apple TV logo. That means it's quickly accessible. So that's pretty good. You should probably set that up straight away. Anyway, back to Luma Fusion. So I've got a video clip here of a carousel and the sunset It's kind of dark. So I'm going to be looking to add some sort of white handwritten text as a title over the top. So what you need now is a drawing app. Now I'm going to use Procreate, but there are loads of free apps on the App Store as well for you to do this. And don't worry if you don't have an Apple Pencil, just use a stylus or if you're good enough just use your finger but I'm just going to set up a blank canvas and what you should probably bear in mind is you've got to think about the color of the text you want and the, how light or dark the background is so as the background of my video is going to be quite dark I'm going to set up a canvas that is uh, black so now I've set up my dark background and the size of the pencil or the brush that I want to use to do the writing I then need to activate screen recordings so I'm going to record all of this screen and then I'm going to overlay it on the video. Now, to do that, I swipe up from the from the bottom to get to control center, and then what I'll do is I'll hit the uh, the record button. You can see mine's already recording because I'm recording this whole thing. Um, so I want to go back into here. So when you press record, you, you have to wait three seconds. It'll tell you it's recording. So let's just draw something. I'm going to draw the title of the video. I recorded this video in Brighton, so I'm just going to write Brighton in text. Just like that. Once you've drawn your text or once you've done the images you want to include, you swipe up from the bottom and you hit stop. And then what you'll be able to do is import that video into LumaFusion. So here I am back inside LumaFusion and I've imported the recording I did of the Brighton writing that I'll be able to put over the top of my video. The first thing we're going to do is resize the, the clip itself. Um, we're going to take out some of the, you can see some of like the sidebar. So what we'll do is we're going to crop some of it out. And I'm going to repos reposition um, the video so it fits in nicely within the frame. Don't worry about the fact that we can see some video over on the left that won't matter in a moment so there you go I've got my Brighton text I've cropped out the sidebar that I didn't want to see it's in the corner it's roughly where I want it so there we go we can see that the text is now going to appear over the top so what we need to do now is go into this video by double tapping on that bit of the timeline and what I'm going to do is in the sort of bottom towards the middle I'm going to choose color and effects and in the top right corner the second one from the right we've got the different the keying the green screens etc so what I'm going to do is use one of those to get rid of the black background so because it's a black background I've chosen dark luma key and you can see now that the text, the animated text, has appeared over the top. So now when I play my video back, it looks great. Now obviously you can do, you can chop that title up if you, or you could speed it up. If you wanted, you felt like he wasn't he wasn't writing quick enough. So what I'll do is I'll just increase the speed a little bit, maybe like twice as fast.
There we go, perfect. So that is how you use your own hand-drawn animated text or drawings in LumaFusion to just bring a whole new element to your videos. If you found this video useful, please like, comment and subscribe and I'll be back soon with another video.